So I'm not going to explain why I was gone for like six days. Instead, I'm going to mediate on the reasons why I'm so great. Well, I can't kind of figure, I really can't figure out any uh, points why, but you know, I just am. So back where we left off, I think we were talking to Mario, organizing the troops, all that shit. And I think we returned to Florence to do some missions for the Medici. But where we're at right now is going to talk to Lorenzo. So let's do it. Sup, nigga? When I was six years old, I fell into the Arno. I soon found myself drifting down and into darkness. Certain my life was at an end. Instead, I woke to the sound of my mother weeping. At her side stood a stranger, soaking and smiling at me. My mother explained that he had saved me. And so began a long and prosperous relationship between two families. Yours and mine. That's so I am sorry gay. I could not save your father and brothers. You have nothing to apologize for. I believe Jacobo de Pazzi played a part in their deaths. They attack on you as well. I need to find him. That coward fled before we could arrest him. Have you any leads? No. They've hidden themselves well. They? Jacopo was not the only conspirator to escape. If they work with Jacopo, they were surely involved in the plot against my family as well. Give me their names. Antonio Maffei. Archbishop Francesco Salviati, Stefano da Bagnone, and Bernardo Baroncelli. Bene, I will go and see my uncle. He has men stationed in the countryside. Wait, before you go. A codex page. I took it from the files of Francesco de Pazzi, seeing as he clearly no longer needs it. I've always had an interest in things of antiquity. As did your father. It is meaningful to me as well. Then consider it a gift. Che il Signore ci protegga. So we've got the fucking Brady Bunch. Jacopo di Pazzi, the money. Yeah, we get it. So right now we're gonna have to talk to uh, Mario. And we do that by stomping out motherfuckers. You. Apparently, we're in a conversation. In order to achieve 100% sync with Ezio's life, you should go exploring. Ah, uh, this shit's gay. I think I'll pass for now. <laughs> Let's um focus with the main mission first. And if there's any loose ends, I'll think about uh. Oh look, it's 2012. Anyways, I'll think about doing any of the side quests at the end. Because I think once we do that, we'll be in the trunk. Oh no, not the trunk, we'll be in the van. Spoiler alert. Um, for some shit. And then we'll have all the time in the world to do everything else. But, for now, let's go talk to uh, Mario. Oh, that was close. And right here is... None other than Leonardo. It's a good thing I don't have to do the bro hug here. I I don't want to be off guard or anything. And apparently my hood disappeared. It's you. Thank God you're all right. This madness with the Medici and the Pazzi. Is this why you pursued Francesco? Not exactly. Well, whatever your reasons, the city is safe again thanks to you. Now tell me, how may I be of service? Ah, another page. Aha, it's a similar cipher to the last one. This won't take long. Interesting. Hmm. Indeed. I see. It's another blade design. For delivering poison. Can you build it? See, it won't take very long. I just need to find a way to hollow out the blade without sacrificing the... It's all right, Leonardo. Just do what you need to do. All done. I filled your blade with a bit of poison to start with. Should you run out, just visit a doctor. 
Oh, okay. Poison from a doctor in high enough doses that which cures can kill. I am in your debt once more, my friend. Anytime, Ezio. Anytime. Good. No quick time events to fuck up. Now, where are we going to talk to Mario and not just Leonardo? He seems to be the guy that is like a total bro, but he pops up when you expect something completely different. Now, we got our secondary memories unlocked. We can do those if we really want to. I mean, of course, as I mentioned before, I won't unless we finish the entire story. Fuck you, bitch. Oh, wait. These are guys we were buddies with first. How about you suck my dick and leave me the fuck alone, you piece of shit? Oh, look, it's one of the Borgia messengers. You gotta go back and get him. You'll get like. Stop running away, come on. And you'll get like that amount of money. So just make your escape right now, and we will go to the next objective. And here we go, falling again. Tackling another person. I'm gonna try to avoid these guys since, you know, they were our friends at one point. Then I end up inadvertently tackling them. And we got about 200 feet to go. Or is that yards or meters? I don't know. If this is what I suspect and we have to go over the wall, then I am going to be very, very disappointed. I am very, very disappointed. Luckily, there's an exit right over there, so we won't have to worry about much. Then we'll get one of the um, horses and we'll make our way out of here. Conveniently outside the city. Just go grab one since nobody seems to care. And make our move out of here. To my understanding, um, Monteriogi is the next place we'll go to, and that's where Mario's at. Now we're hiaing and yeah, all the way to the palazzo. You just dismount right when we get on the gates and we can't go any further. And let's go up here. For some reason, whenever I go around Monteriogi, um, the FPS drops around 20. That's probably because of, I don't know, the atmosphere. As well as, you know, it being a lot more dense than any other map, presumably, in the game. Pretty sure Mario is upstairs. Let's find out. Oh, I guess not. Let's just drop down. Ezio! <laughs> come in, come in! To what do we owe the honor? You standing there every time I need to ask you for a mission? I don't know. Been sent from Firenze by Il Magnifico to attend to some unfinished business. I'm looking for Jacopo de Pazzi. Ha! Who isn't? We've been at it for days. And perhaps what I carry will help us both. A list of his co-conspirators. One of them will talk before he dies. Excellent. These men are sure to lack Jacopo's resources, which means they will be easier to find. I will put my scouts to it at once. I appreciate the help, Uncle. Got something else for you as well. More codex pages. Ah, let's see what we can learn. What is this? What profit? What did you find, Uncle? Just another damn mystery. The text here roughly translates to only the prophet may open it. There's reference to two pieces of Eden, but these pages offer no answers, Nipote. At least, not on their own. You must find more. We'll have to save it for another day, Uncle. I have a mission to attend to. Well, As you call it mission. Now, if you hope to defeat these bastardi, I will need to teach you a few things. Meet me on the practice field. Oh boy, here we go. Now, if I chose the clan, it would just like restart the entire conversation. So, what do you want right, to teach me? You're familiar with counterattacking, but what happens when your enemy is as well? 
I don't usually give them the opportunity. Tough talk offers little protection against Templar steel. Then by all means, Maestro. Teach me what to do. Now dodge. I don't know. How do so I dodge, face. man? Dying just to follow orders. Bene, bene. Now do it again. Much better. One last time now. Bravo. Now we're going to disarm him. Oh, wrong one. Here you got it. Let's see it another time. Where do you get all these swords from? Feel your Detroit. Enjoy the ride down no. there. Just one more time, Enzo. Why don't you just pick up the old swords? Like, seriously. Whatever. Magnifico. Once again, you exceed my expectations. Well, you don't really have high ones. Signore, we found Jacopo's men. And they wait your word to strike. Hey, we'll guy from Skyrim. No man moves until they have spoken with Ezio. Intesi. It will be done. Go, Ezio. Visit with my mercenaries in the countryside. See if Jacopo's lackeys won't lead you to him. But be careful. They will be expecting you. I'll just have to give him the old sup, nigga. And I'll be on my way. Now we learned to dodge and everything. The enemies will be a lot smarter than they were at the beginning of the game. They'll know how to dodge, do all that basic stuff. And, um... If you were to fight with any like large NPCs, those are basically the most knowledgeable and the most um, strong out of all of them. So I'm going to be making my way out right here, and we'll be going towards the um, horse right here. And we shall be going. Right to Tuscany. So right now, we're slightly notorious, but not that much. Just be going around a little bit, stealth and shit. Yeah, right. Um, what we're going to do, basically, is go around the open fields, and if there are any enemy patrols on the main roads, we just avoid them. There are going to be a few missions, like the ones right here, and you can pick them in just about any order. So right now, I think I'm going to one of the uh, churches out in the open. Now, I might say you're getting far away from one because one of them is selected as the main objective, but it shouldn't make that much of a difference. Right here in Tuscany, you have a lot of open field and you have a lot of room to roam. So we're just going up right here. And we've made it. So disarm ourselves we got our first set of um, assassinations to do we found Archbishop Salviati he's barricaded himself inside that villa take some of my men use them to clear the fields then find a way over the wall so you can open the gates <sighs> command over my own army a nice change of pace from the usual sneaking and stabbing. I like it. So let's go get our first target. Going all nice and stealth. Huh, there's my posse. So we're gonna have to find our way over the gates. We're gonna try and do this all stealth and shit because... They see me, they're all mean and stuff. Ah, oh, fuck you. Let's do this, come on. Oh, my bad. And these are um, the second to most powerful in the game. These guys right here. They're a lot faster than us, and if they do catch us, they will... Um, Oh crap, that's right. If you happen to fight in this uh, level, you will be a little bit of uh, assaulted. So, 
Just get your little cannon fodder buddies away. So you can do your own stuff. Ah, crap. Yep, it takes a while. You might want to start up here. It's a nice beginning. The other NPCs and foes will be busy. The assassin has arrived! Yeah, no shit. Need to find a way to open the gates. I don't know. Maybe that one over there. You know, just saying. Ugh. You didn't see shit. Hey, I warned you to stay away, assassin. You should have listened. Now the gates open. What are you gonna do, huh? What? Now, where's that pussy over there? Do we have to do one of these fights? Oh, man. I'm clobbering everyone. Bitch. Last few people over here. Seems like this guy is probably the last one we have to kill. Oh shit, he's making big damage. Not on, not on my watch. And my, you know, personal army. You know what? This is getting boring. Actually, let me pick this guy up so I can see if I can attack him from behind. There we go. Shit. Nobody gets mercy for me. Where is Jacopo? He knows you come for him. Emerging only in darkness to meet with the others. That answers when. Now tell me where. Fede dovrebbe dare conforto. Non pena. Requiescat in pace. Yet we say absolutely nothing. It's like you don't even give him time to either fight. You can fight or flee for the conflict, but... Apparently they don't seem to care either. Now, if I can't find my horse, it's going to be a long distance back, so... Oh, look, a horse over here. Hey, hey! We got our uh, first few set of missions, again. Our notoriety has um, increased exponentially, and that's because we killed a big figure, of course. I don't think here in the countryside we're going to find much poster posters of us. But there might be a few heralds here and there, especially in the main city over there. But um, I think over here is the church and we can assassinate him, become one of the crowds. And let's see if that works. Oh yeah, and that's right. I think there's like a smoke bomb ability, which I don't have yet. Yeah, I don't. Oh well. Ah, there you are. Listen. We found Stefano da Bagnone. Just follow this road and it'll bring you to the abbey where he's taken refuge. Wait, before you go, take these. You can use them to create a distraction. Well, there's a smoke My thanks, bombs. friend. Let's go ahead and take those. Make our way up. Oh, yeah, that's right. We can't go that way. But where we can go is, you know, take a fucking horse up there and say, What's going on, everyone? I'm just, you know, the guy in a horse. Don't mind me. Hey, hey. Yeah, I like being all nice and subtle and shit. Up here, it's going to be a lot more difficult to find and single somebody out. The Lord's protection. If you think the Lord has any interest in our affairs, you have another thing coming. But please, by all means, continue to delude yourself if it helps to pass the time. You speak blasphemy. No, I speak truth. But to deny his most exalted existence is the only rational response when faced with the declaration that there exists some invisible madman in the sky. And believe me, if your precious Bible is anything to go by, he you there. What do you want? Are you friend or foe? No, you're gonna let me do this now? Oh, what's up? Wear his vestments. What's going on, bro? <laughs> oh shit, I get to kill his buddy too. You guys wearing the priest. Who was right? Where is Jacopo? 
Nothing to fear, I suppose. They meet in the shadow of the Roman gods. Ora sei libero dalla paura. Requiescat in pace. So I only had to kill those two guys, right? Or is it something bigger? Well, those two guys are dead. And these guys don't even seem to care for now. I might as well make my leave now. Come on, get on. Let's go. Oh, fuck. Shit. Yeah, I'm already out of the common eye. You knew I was the best. Now we're almost to uh, full variety, which is somewhat of an achievement and somewhat pretty bad because every guard that will see us will go ape shit around us and like break our cover. But for now, let's just go up here, get the last two people. Oh look, there's one of those politician guys. But unfortunately, we're gonna have to make our way around here. Let's see if we can do anything. Fortunately, there's not a group of um, people to block the entrance. Just this fucking horse. Alright, let's go get that guy. He doesn't even seem to notice, which is really great. I don't see how killing these guys in front of two guards lowers my notoriety, but you know, it's totally perfect. Then I get the last one, which is a poster of me that I'm going to be removing while under hot pursuit of a bunch of guards. Oh wait, no, that's not a bunch of guards, that's rather a crowd. You there, stop if you say so. What's you? There! Ah, oh, crap. What are you talking about? I'm undercover, yo. <laughs> yeah, what? 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 What are you gonna do, huh? You're going down. See ya. Oh, bunch of uh, other things to do. Man, this is one big city. I can't see him anymore. He's here somewhere. Find him. Who are you gonna find, huh? Who are you gonna find? You too. Now we're undercover. Did this guy just steal my money? I don't see what else I lost, but... Why are you here? Get down! Ah, oh, crap. Go on faster. Why I'm sorry. Carry on. I'm sorry. Can we talk about it? Yeah, just give me my money back that apparently you took. He's there on him! Nobody did you. I didn't mean any harm. All right. You can take care of him, guard. It's not my problem anymore. Oh wait, I can tackle him again. I'll give it all back. Just let me go. Oh crap. You'd think someone would teach him a little respect. Maybe you should call your wife. Okay, that was a little bit awkward, but next assassination target. About time you got here. We found Bernardo Baroncelli. Oh, that's great. Ultima notizia. Tell me where he is and I'll see that he's dealt with. That's the trap. Lorenzo actually had him arrested days ago, after being returned to us from Constantinople. But he escaped. We believe him to be somewhere inside San Gimignano. Va bene. I'll see if I can't pin him down. How do you expect to succeed where the rest of us have failed? I have my ways. That sounds so elusive, but it's not. You see a little map, see the green part, and you go in it, and then you turn on Eagle Vision. That's pretty complicated for a bunch of fucking ways. 
But, you know, I don't want to be that cynical when it comes to this shit because I really need to find that guy. So we're somewhere around here. Can't really pinpoint where. So we're just gonna go and ladder and troll the rooftops. You get bored, lost, confused, distracted, killed. It will be okay. And if he does come, oh look, there he is. If it happens, I keep moving. Never in one place for long. Oh crap! I'm right here, bitch. Oh fuck! There goes two of them. You're next, motherfucker. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do, huh? I'm not gonna let that pussy get away. What the fuck are you doing, punk? Why do I call you punk? You're nothing more than a bitch. Where are the goddamn guards? Not here, pussy. You know what? I'm not even gonna kill you with the hidden blade. Let's punch it out. Come on. Away from me, assassin! Away! Knock the fuck down. I knew you would come. Where is Jacobo? So you can do to him what you've done to me? Yep. There is still time for you to clear your conscience. We gather at the church when a meeting is called. Mi duole dover giungere a tanto. Requiescat in pace. I'll just be making my leave again after all of these times. Hey, look, there's a horse. Let's be a little bit creative with this. Huh. Well, I guess we have to go back in there. Yeah, don't mind me, guards. Hey, look, it's one of those uh, things. We'll do that after, maybe. Salute, Ezio. Antonio Maffei has sought refuge atop the city's tallest structure, spouting scripture and arrows in equal measure. The man has clearly lost his mind. Making matters worse, he's posted archers all around him. You do well to clear them out before approaching. Grazie for the information. Oh, I have a feeling. I remember when I did this mission. There's a motherfucker that just talked shit all the way up on top of the rooftops. And of course, you have to take him out. There he is up there. Now we have to find our way around with those uh, four buildings over there. But the problem is we have to deal with all the archers. Or, you know, we don't have to, but the thing is, you got to be really careful because they will shoot the hell out of you. So, better to be safe than sorry. Just make sure you make your way up and do it nice and quick. So right now we have to climb the first building that involves getting up here. And we'll just go around. And look, we're already up on here. The problem is, you're gonna have to deal with a bunch of angry archers. But fortunately for us, they haven't seemed to. Uh, I haven't seemed to catch their attention yet, so we should be good. We're gonna go around. There we go. But you see, we're gonna we're gonna kill him a little bit more embarrassingly by throwing him the fuck off the building. Oh shit, he's not he's still here? I will put you on your knees, sinner. You would enjoy that, wouldn't you? Thank forgiveness. I have no need to. Yes, because throwing you over to the stone really kills you. Away with you, demon. Have some respect for death, my friend. I'll show you respect. No, I will. E tu possa al fine trovare riposo. Corpo e nella mente. Requiescat in pace. No, I didn't even get the stab. Aww. 
You know, that makes me very, very angry. You know what I'm gonna do, bitch? Come on. What are you gonna do, huh? Are you gonna punch me already? It's a fight, face so Try fighting for it. No, kill him! Yeah, so much for that fight you were talking about. Well, I'm just gonna jump inconspicuously into a bale of hay that I can't even find. Oh wait, there it is. And if I missed, my skull would be cracked and parts of my body would be lying there on the road street. Good thing that didn't happen though. So let's be going up. Going up once more. And here's where they supposedly meet. Accept the mission without even reading the details. And see where this Jacopo punk is hanging around. If I can stay my blade long enough to follow him, he'll lead me to his Templar brothers. I'll have oh, right, that's for a There he is. Well, when things like this happen, where they all, like, ask for money like a bunch of fucking Brazilians, just throw coins at them. Wait. Oh. What's going on here? Are they late? They haven't seen me this much, I know. No, oh, they don't even illusion. They don't even work as an illusion. It's so useless. Huh. Well, you know what, guys? Y'all can fuck off. Because I'm getting these bitches instead. Stay away from the guards because, yeah, that'll happen. These two are still with me, but they'll take a little bit longer to uh, work as an distraction. What are you and the others planning, Jacopo? We're walking back here and we're asking all these damn questions we don't even understand while we wait for everything to take place. We have to get a little bit away and punch him. Nobody likes to hear shitty music. Well, looks like our first set of hookers are no longer with us. So, we're gonna do something a little bit more MLG. So, climb up here and watch him from the rooftops. In instances where, you know, there's a guy right here, just throw a knife. Even though his body's right in front of there, he just gives his little grievances, doesn't seem to care in the slightest, and continues on his path. Now he's gonna be making his way out of the city, so it's actually a good thing I got up here. And we'll just take blue tops. The most ironic thing of all is he hasn't even looked back and seen if anyone was following him, which is kinda weird, but works to my advantage, so I can't really complain. Just watch him leave over there. Gently pushing the guards out of his way, but they seem to keep on blocking him. Go up here. Watch him, watch over him, over here. And I'll wait a good five seconds because when we jump, we'll probably jump around that general direction. And it should be about time. <laughs> so once Your we have our bit of are there Templars there as well? He might be going to Venice, but we don't really know at this point. So we'll just keep on following him, blending in places where we need to, and going to the other places as time goes by. We may be going to Venice, but we might not. It's virtually unknown at this point, but 
I think over here, the way I'm looking right now, is where they meet up. I think I'm going to find one of those uh, Pope people. And I'll have to end up <sighs> fighting him. Or a bunch of his accomplices. I'm going to take the long jump up here. Ah, oh, crap. Well, that plan is completely out of the picture. But we are close. And even though he walks a little bit weird, he doesn't seem to care. So, follow this crowd of people going this one way. And watch as they go as expected. Some noble stud, no doubt. Into the rose bushels we Break go. Something, the idiots. Ride bene chi ride ultimo. We're gonna hire All these right. goons. All yours. Have fun. Another called the That could be a man. Better have a look. While we're avoiding all these angry guards, how many men are responsible for my father's death? What happened to him? Eavesdrop on the meeting right like about the now. <gasps> I'm sorry, Maestro. I did all I could, but the assassin proved too strong. Clearly, as the others would be here with you. Say nothing of the fact that Firenze remains in Medici hands. It's Francesco's fault. His impatience made him reckless. I, I tried to be the voice of reason. More like the voice of cowardice. You're one to talk, Signor Barbarigo. And you sent us quality weapons instead of this garbage you Venetians call armament. We put our faith in your family, and you repay us with inaction and incompetence? Then when asked to account for your failures, you make excuses and insult us? How do you expect me to respond? I You're gonna kill know. me. It's all right. I do. Here goes the blade. Bitch. Uh, uh, no. Please. No, don't. <laughs> Please don't what? I can fix this. Spare me. No. What a mess. So sorry to have claimed your prize. Assassin. You know what, here goes Did you honestly time, right? think I wouldn't expect you to follow? That I didn't plan for it? We've been at this a lot longer than you. Kill him. Oh, really? Here we go. I know you're only doing as you're told. So if you release me, I will spare your lives. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, bitch. Let's do this fighting thing, right? <laughs> Come on. Well, you guys aren't worth anything. I'm gonna just kill him. Finish him. Fire, amigo. Libero da fardelli e paure. Requiesca di pace. Well, it looks like that prize was claimed after all. <laughs> Keep on panting, you're dead. Come on. Yes, I, I see the finish him already. We don't need to kill these guys. We can just leave, and the mission will be passed. Clear the strada! Stay I can't see him so go down <laughs> here. And a long distance later, we should be relatively unfound. I don't mind the fact the guard is running this weird way, but, you know, mission's passed. And, top of that, sequence 5 is completed. So, what do we do? Well, I think you know what. Everything starts fucking melting. There goes nothing. <laughs> 